Hey guys and welcome back to Rock My Face. Today I'm going to do something for you that someone posted on my Facebook page. I had put a link up saying that if anyone had any pictures or any looks that they would like for me to do, then just post them up there. And this was the first one I got. Um, and it's a picture of Rihanna. So I have, if you see me looking this way, I am looking at the picture. Um, but I think it's going to be pretty cool. It's kind of similar to the one we did um, with the yellow shadow. But I'm going to give it a little bit more of a lime green look to it instead of just the yellow. Just to switch it up just a little bit. So, let's get started. I'm going to start with my MAC um, Studio Fix Fluid Foundation. And I'm just using a stippling brush. Rihanna has beautiful skin. Even without makeup on. So... Okay, now that my foundation is on, I'm going to conceal underneath the eyes. Any blemishes that you have. I'm going to pop a little bit of primer on the lid. And I'm just going to buff that in with my finger. Now I'm going to start off with this really, let me see, I don't know if you can see that well. It's just a really lime green color. I don't know why it's not showing up good on the camera, but it is brilliant. So, I'm going to put that right on the lids. Now I'm going to take a small accent brush in a matte brown and starting on the outside corner of my crease on the socket bone here, I'm going to run it straight over. Now I'm going to take a clean shadow brush and buff that out just a little bit on the top. Now I'm going to take this color here in the Click It Your It palette, and it's number 9. It's almost like an orangey color. And I'm going to place that right underneath the line we just drew. Now I'm going to take a pixel point brush. I'm going to take number 19 on this palette. It's a cream brown. And I want one sharp line running straight through. We're not going to blend it. We're going to leave it sharp. And it's right at the socket bone. Thank you. 
Okay, now for the liner, I'm going to use a black gel liner. In the waterline. And also right at the lash line. Rihanna has a really strong liner in this picture, so. Now, if you find it easier to use a liquid liner, you're more than welcome to use that here. It's no problem. Okay, now for the brows, let me see if I can find, she obviously has a really dark brow, but I'm still going to use just brown for me just because I do want it to still look somewhat natural, um, and I'm going to just trace along the top of my brow here, and I'm using a straight edge brush so I can really get it sharp. And I'm going to go in with a lighter color underneath. Now, as far as contouring goes, I'm going to run some brown. I'm just going to take my finger and I'm going to run it in the hollows of my cheeks. And I'm also going to do it on the side. I'm going to run it right here on each side of my nose, up here. And also along my jaw. Now I'm just going to take my contouring brush here and I'm going to blend that in. Now for the lashes, I'm going to just apply a coat of mascara. Now for lashes, I'm just going to place them straight on there. Now, while those dry, I'm going to go ahead and do my blush. I'm going to start off using this cream um, blush called Fresh Pink. Well, maybe I am. I'm going to use a powder brush. Now, Rihanna has really high cheekbones, so we're going to start on the outside here. I'm just not really crazy about this blush here. Now the color she's wearing in this picture I don't have in a blush, but I do have a similar eyeshadow and I'm going to use that. So I'm going to use this palette and I'm going to use both of these pinks. This is the NYX palette we used the other day um, and I'm going to use the hot pink and the cherry cool. I'm going to start off by using the darker one. I'm going to put it right on the outside of the eye. 
and really buff that in. Same on the other side. And then I'm going to place that hot pink on top of it. Now, just to mesh that all together, I'm going to take my buffing brush and run it right over. Now, I have this um, really super light pink. Um, it's a pink highlight. And it, what it's used for throwing the lid around. What it's used for is to um, highlight whatever parts, like if I had a really flat face and say I wanted to look like I had higher cheekbones, I could pop this highlight right on top of it and it'll bring light to that area. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a little bit of that. Let me get some. I'm just going to pop some in my lid here. doesn't take very much. It does come out fast though. And I'm going to pop it right over that blush. on this side. This is great for photo shoots, uh, drag makeup. Also going to place some right in the middle of my forehead and just on the tip of my nose and on the outer corners. Cupid's bow and chin. Now on her lips she has this really pretty pink and this is an Urban Decay pink and it is called something. Quickie. That's what it's called. Sorry. Now I'm going to take that hot pink um, shadow again and I'm going to dust that over the lips. Just to set that. And then I'm going to go over it with a pink gloss. 